feel so good to me. Every time I come back, I try to leave. So how you end up back with me? Oh, this ain't what I want. This is something else. Something that ain't good for my health. And I've been searching, but I can't get no help. She looks crazy, but I'm gonna go ahead and do my hair because this is not giving. So let me tell you something. So I had already had content ready for you guys, right? And some way, somehow, I guess God was like, no, you gotta come better, come harder because I went to go edit and I was originally using CapCut for desktop, desktop and CapCut was lagging so bad. I mean, really, really bad. It was, it just made editing annoying. I'm one of those people that like, I'm a simple edit kind of girl. As long as my quality, my sound and everything sounds good. Like that's, that's all I care about. So some way, somehow I, I had recorded probably like Friday or Saturday or probably both started editing on Sunday, but CapCut was lagging so bad that for whatever reason, I just, it wasn't working for me. So then Monday I was like, all right, it should be, you know, refreshed, ready to keep going. Nope, still lagging. So Monday comes. Monday still lagging, still not doing anything. So now I'm switching between Final Cut Pro, Adobe Premiere, CapCut again. And I'm just like, nothing is working for me. So then finally, I just was like, all right, I'm gonna give Adobe Premiere Pro one more go. So I go to insert my SIM card for my camera and all of a sudden this thing just says, basically it's a corrupted file. Like it can no longer read my SIM card. So I had three videos on there, makeup tutorial, hair and all, and it's gone. So I guess God was just like, yeah, you're gonna have to give new content. And I'm just like, oh my gosh. So that's what I'm gonna do for you guys. I'm gonna just do my hair for one because obviously I'm not gonna give you makeup or tutorial or anything for that nature with my hair looking the way it looks. So I figured, you know, why not give you guys a little one-two with my favorite hairstyle and then we could just talk. Um, specifically just talking about starting over. So I don't know if you guys know that last year around this time, specifically February 13th, um, I had decided, you know what, I'm going to take YouTube seriously. I'm going to take myself seriously. If I want to be a full-time content creator, I have to act as such. And it was a long journey. I went through, you know, mental breakdowns. I went through feeling like I had imposter syndrome. And I'm not going to lie, sometimes I feel like I still go through the whole imposter syndrome because I'm just like, you know, who am I trying to be? What am I trying to do? And I still feel like I'm just trying to fine tune that specifically. But I just want to make sure that you know, I'm reaching the right people and the right people receive my message. For one, you know, with being a mother and being a wife, you know, it's easy for your identity to get lost. And not even just with that, even just as simple as, you know, you trying to find out who you are in school or at work and you're realizing you don't want to work these nine to five jobs. Like you just, you go through this whole period of trying to find yourself 
And I believe I had went through that because I was just, I was so lost. And fast forward to now, and it's about to be a full year that I decided to take my YouTube series, at least I'll say that. Because if you know me, you know that I've been posting on like Instagram for a long time. But I even stopped there just because, like I said, I just, you know how sometimes you feel like you just can't win with certain platforms? Yeah, that, that was me. Um, I felt like I hit a stagnant point on there. Then TikTok came in and really took the girlies to a different level. So yeah, that's kind of just where I'm at with everything right now, honestly. Everything is just like, I found a platform that works for me, which is YouTube. I'm focusing on that because I don't have the energy or really the time to navigate all of the socials. So YouTube may see more of me than TikTok, Pinterest, and Instagram. But just know that I'm, I'm gonna get my way around there. I'm, I'm gonna find my way. But just as of now, YouTube has just been my girly. And I'm all for, like I said, starting over. And essentially, I feel like if you're passionate about something, you're always going to be starting over because you're always going to be bettering yourself. So don't look at starting over as such a bad thing. Sometimes it's worse if you don't start over because you're trying to use the same tools that were never working before or have ran its course with working. So now you're like, oh, I'm stuck. You're stuck because you won't start over. Baby, just start over. That's all you got to do. All right. So now that I got my hair party, this looks crazy. <laughs> I'm going to go in with chi, chai, whatever you want to call it and i'm going to put some more of this silk infusion in my thick hair i'm trying to get her to grow out some more y'all this is the first time in a long time i went and got my nails done yeah that's all i'm gonna say it was very meh i'll say that much i'll just stick with being one of those girlies who prefers to just use Ouch. Ooh, my hair is thick y'all but sticking to press-ons because there's no way that I should have paid what I paid and not left out happy about what I got. Y'all, I combed out my hair, but she's just acting like a thick gent today and not really wanting to work for me. All right, so now that I got that hot combed, what I'm going to do is I'm going to just take my flat iron like so. I don't plan on doing too many passes. I'm not the type of person that likes hella heat in their hair just cause I went through a, a phase of just my hair being horrible. And I'm not trying to go back to that. So call me scared or whatever, but I know my hair and my hair don't be going for all that, uh, that heat. I put heat to my hair probably Oh my gosh, I can't even think about it. Y'all you, you, know I'm always in my wig, so I honestly, I can't even tell you the times. I know I put heat to my hair in the vlog where I got my hair done with this color and the uh, clip-ins. And then I'm doing it again now, so it, twice. And this is honestly probably going to be the last time I put heat to my hair. I don't, I don't care to be doing it too often.
Good morning, everybody. Today is the day I get to schedule my um, appointment. Ah! So you guys are about to hear me call actually right now. So let's go ahead and do it. I'm not even gonna waste time because I'm so excited. So let's see. 